just a couple of changes. Uh, well, one, we updated our administrator list. Last year we didn't have an administrator at East Franklin at the time of the handbook, so we updated that. Page 37 on the tobacco policy. Uh, some of the principals have expressed an interest in trying to include the use of these electronic cigarettes. It just says the use of and or possession of tobacco in any form, which I felt like kind of saying any form would take care of that. But they felt like a lot of people was trying to get around it so that we might need to spell out the electronic cigarettes that some of them are trying to use. So uh, we'd like to add that to the tobacco policy. And then on page, I believe it's page 51, graduation requirements. <clears throat> you know, last year, the State Department had voted to do away with the Alabama High School graduation exam. So what we're doing is we're just putting in the new graduation requirements that's required by the state. And we put in, uh, I can tell you, read to you what we put in. It's just real short here. Uh, we inserted in with full implement implementation of Alabama's college and career readiness standards and the adoption of assessments aligned with these standards, the diploma options for the first time ninth graders of 2010 and 11 are being revised in accordance with the November 14, 2013 resolution approved by the Alabama State Board. Board of Education, the Franklin County Board of Education no longer requires students to pass the Alabama High School graduation exam to earn a diploma. So that little short segment will be, and anything that uh, relates to the Alabama High School graduation diploma will be deleted because it's, you know, it's going away. Okay, so that's what we did with the uh, uh, graduation requirements. And then on page, 69, this has to do with the child nutrition programs. Uh, last year, they put, there were some changes, and it was uh, the new meal pattern and the old meal pattern requirements. I think they could go by either last year, but now then they have to go with the new requirements, and uh, we will just be where it says the new requirements, they will be in here, the old requirements will be gone. So. That's, uh, that's all it is there. And then there was one other short change it's to, I think it's on page 69. Also, it talks about the gifted program. <coughs> Actually, it's on page 70. And we just added a little section there about the, left the gifted program there, I left all that in, but just added uh, special education slash gifted because uh, special ed is included with that. And it just talked, we just said that the Franklin County school system provides appropriate educational opportunities to children with disabilities ages three to 21 that are eligible for services within the district. The school system ensures that a free, appropriate public education consistent with the standards established by the local special, special education plan and by state federal regulations is being provided to all children with disabilities ages 3 to 21. And then from there, it just goes to the gifted services. And that's it. Any questions? About it? Any of those? Have you got in, is, is it got in there where we, that we talked about on the, uh, Class ranking. Uh, you know, the last board meeting we talked about. Right. Changing. Well, it, it just talks about how the uh, high school principals and, and the uh, appropriate staff members are, are to design and implement the graduation exercises, but uh, to actually, well, it just talks about meeting the Carnegie units, but as far as the... Uh, we need to put that in there, but y'all know what we talked mm -hmm. about the last meeting. We, right. we need to put that in right. there, so when right. we approve it, that'll be part of it.
Do y'all need any further explanation? Do you have any questions about the school buses? Which one we want to replace? Uh, one time you ordered a, 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 several of them. Is that going? Is this going to replace some older replacement buses? This will replace what well, we got. One ninety six on the route. We've got 198 on the route. And we've got 399 on the route. That will replace these three buses. We're doing away with one route that you're aware of. Uh, this will replace the four, and then it will replace the uh, the span program bus, which has over 200,000 miles. But, and it will be put on the vocational route. Vocational route, route yes. Unless we have to have a route at Tharp Town, cause, and we'll use it there. And then put the 98 on the bocast. Right, probably 99. 99. Right. We have three 99s that are on the route. So. so you're trading three in? And we'll just have them for spares. They won't get any ball no way. We don't get anything for them. We need, but we don't have enough spares either, especially during baseball and softball season.
take and institute for $24,000. That's uh, school safety. They came in and did a presentation with Johnny McMorris, Solomon and Montgomery. They gave a presentation. And then they came here and did one. And uh, he, uh, that money comes from him. The 24000 Yeah. We, the county board is not out of dime. That's all money he's made up. Pay them for what they've already done, and then they're going to, that will pay for a year. I think each school is $3,000 each for a year. And uh, that covers next year. So by the time school's in, they'll have it. So training for teachers will be online. Uh, it'll beef us up a little bit on security. Not as much as we want to be, but it, it'll help some. said Johnny Mac, he and Roger both. I'm going to call the mate and daughter, if y'all don't mind, let's stand. Mr. Board's going to lead us in prayer, and after that, Mr. Oliver is going to lead us in the pledge. Our dear Heavenly Father, we come to you in prayer at this time, thanking you for this wonderful day you've blessed us with, <clears throat> thanking you for all the many blessings of life we've been so abundantly blessed with. We just thank you, Father, for the country we live in and the freedoms and opportunities we have. We just pray, Father, that you be with our board today as they meet, as they make decisions for our schools, that they might be able to make the decisions that would be in the best interest of all schools. We just ask now, Father, that you be with us throughout each and every day of our life and forgive us where we fail thee. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. Gentlemen, please. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <laughs> Four, can I get a motion to approve the agenda? So moved. I have a motion for Mr. Baker. Need a second? Second. Second, Mr. Oliver. All in favor? Aye. Motion carries 4 0. Can I get a motion to approve the minutes of the July 13th, uh, May 13th meeting? I'll make a motion. Need a second? Second. Second, Mr. Baker. All in favor? Aye. Motion carries 4 0. Item number six. <clears throat> I recommend that you accept payment of bills for the period of May the 7th, 2014 through June the 10th. Can I get a motion? I'll make a motion. A motion, Mr. Oliver, need a second? Second. Second, Mr. Baker, all in favor? Aye. You in favor? I'm going to abstain at this time. I have three in favor and one abstain. Item number seven. I recommend you approve the financial report for April of 2014. Can I get a motion? Motion. Have a motion, Mr. Baker. Need a second? I'll second. Second, Mr. Oliver. All in favor? Aye. Motion carries 4 0. Item number 8. I recommend you rescind the action of May 13, 
2014 board meeting concerning intent to transfer Brittany Sykes from Phil Campbell Elementary teacher to elementary teacher at Bell Green School. Okay, can I get a motion? Motion. Motion, Mr. Oliver. Need a what, second. What? She was transferred from Phil Campbell to Bell Green. She was, and then a, another teacher from Phil Campbell got a job in another system, so it put Brittany right back at Phil Campbell. I'll second it. All in favor? Motion carries four zero. Number number nine. Mr. Danny, you got any attorney news? <coughs> I don't have anything. Either. Item number ten. Good news. That's right. Yeah. I recommend that you award the following bids: uh, the paper bid to Strickland Paper Company, and the LP Gas to Thompson Gas Company. They were both the lowest. What about possible bid? Diesel. And also the diesel to Tatum oil, lowest responsible bid. Okay, can I get a motion? I'll make a motion. A motion, Mr. Schubert. Need a second? Second. Second, Mr. Baker. All in favor? Motion carries 4 0. Item number 11. Award bid for Microsoft Surface Pro 2 tablets to CDW government, lowest responsible bid at a bid price of 532.83 each. Total for 26 of them is 13853.58. Okay, can I get a motion? I'll make a motion. Need a second? I'll second. Second, Mr. Oliver. All in favor? Motion carries 4 0. Item number 12. I recommend you approve the purchase of four new school buses. Can I get a motion for that? No. Who said that? Yes. Motion, Mr. Baker. Need a second? Second. Second, Mr. Schubert. All in favor? Motion carries 4 0. Item number 13. I recommend you approve the Franklin County Child Nutrition Program joining the Northwest Alabama Child Nutrition Program Cooperative Consortium. The group will generate supplemental bids as needed within the Child Nutrition Program. How about a motion? Well, is that just kind of grouping together to bid the purchase? Yeah, as just a group. A group. Yeah, just like a state bid. So I'll make a motion or a second. I have a motion, Mr. Oliver, a second, Mr. Schubert, all in favor? Motion carried, 4-0. Item number 14. I recommend you approve the contract for occupational therapy services with Patricia Burns and Associates for the period of August the 1st through July 14th through July 31st, 2015, at a rate of $100 per evaluation and $50 for one half hour direct therapy services. Travel expenses will be compensated at the prescribed mileage rate of the school system. An additional charge of $100 will be charged if the therapist is required to travel to serve only one student. Is this compatible to what we paid this last year? It was the very same, except we didn't have that one student, one student. bill in there. Yeah, but everything else is signed. Can I get a motion? I'll make a motion. How about a second? Second. Second, Mr. Oliver, all in favor? Motion carries 4 0. Item number 15. I recommend you approve the 2014 15 student handbook with the changes that we've talked about in the work session. How about a motion? Make a motion. Motion, Mr. Oliver, need a second? Second. Second, Mr. Baker, all in favor? Motion carries 4 0. Item number 16, personnel. I have a long personnel list here, and I will recommend in a minute to accept it all in one vote. But I, I, I know we have some folks from Red Bay here, and you're interested in what's going on. We have several personnel issues at Red Bay, and I'm going to tell you them, and then I'm going to recommend to the board that they approve it. You want to recommend the whole list, though, right? I'm going to recommend the whole list when I get. But first, let me do this. We've got is Miss Kay Hargett still here? She walked out. But she's retiring. Mm -hmm. She turned to Red Kay Taylor's retiring in she's September. Here. She's here. There she is. I didn't see you. Miss okay. Taylor, I want to thank you for your service. Forty, how many years? Um, Forty, I think. Forty years. Well, she's retiring in September, and she turned her resignation in today so we could move on getting her a replacement. So I want to thank her for what she's done. At Red Bay, uh, We'll recommend that Michael Jackson be hired as social studies teacher and head football coach. 
Richard Majerese, uh, social studies and head baseball coach. Jeff Madden, full-time assistant principal. And it's time for Mr. Sparks' contract, or so we're recommending he get a five-year extension on his contract. And that five years is basically a common contract, is that right? Yeah, it's just a signed salary. It's just not a whole lot different from a teacher team. But it's, I mean, that. I, it's, I, don't, think we've gone, I don't think we've done one less than five years. That's what I'm saying. If the five years come oh, throughout common. the state. I don't know about throughout the state now. I mean, you, you got to do three. Your first year. Any year. Anytime you knew it, you got to do three. Okay. At least. <clears throat> But, I, you know, our principals, I think, in our county, we have the best group of principals that probably we've ever but had. also, when you and the Bell Green principal, the same thing. Bell Green principal, same five years, yeah. This is her first one, though, right? That's her first years. one, yeah. You okay. You do a you do a probationary contract the first, when they first hire for one or two years. Okay. After that, it's got to be at least three if you renew them, or you can non-renew them, period. But if you renew them, you got to do at least three. Plus the max, you know. Ain't no five max. Years, no five. Max. That's negotiable. Is a common, I think. Five is what we've done. I don't, I don't remember one doing less than five years since I've been on. I, since think, I, we may have, I think we may have done a three, but it, it, I, don't, I don't remember. I have. Yeah. Anyhow, go ahead. Yeah, it's pretty common, though, five years. I recommend that you approve this entire personnel action sheet. Can I get a motion? Motion. Motion, Mr. Baker. I need a second. I'll second. Second, Mr. Oliver. All in favor? Motion carries 4 0. Item number 17. Any other business? Item number 18. Next board meeting to be July 22nd, 2014 at 5 15 with a work session at 5. Item number 19. Can Let I me get say a, something about that. That might have to be adjusted depending on. They always might have to be. They might that just goes without saying, though. Yeah, but I mean, school's about to start, and we don't know what's about to happen, so it could have to be adjusted, so maybe not. Item number 19, can I get a motion to adjourn? A motion. Uh, I have a motion with Mr. Oliver. Need a second? Second. Second, Mr. Baker. All in favor? Meeting adjourned. I don't usually get them back.